In today's video, we're going to be opening up what I personally think might be the coolest Pokemon card item of 2023. It is none other than the Pokemon 151 UPC, aka the Ultra Premium Collection Box. And this bad boy, I honestly think, if I was going to ask for anything at Christmas time at this point, it would easily be this bad boy right here. Oh wow, there's a lot. What is that, a playmat? Now this right here has got to be the reason why I'm convinced you've got to buy this box. Mainly because, check this out, I don't know how to get these out without damaging it so much. Full Metal Golden Mute EX card, which is actually a proper card inside of 151. But they've made an entire metal version of it. And they put it as a guaranteed card inside of this 2PC, which is just absolutely awesome. I can't get over they put an actual... Like metal Mew card in here that's fully gold. That's awesome and it looks really nice. But you know what's crazy? That's not what I'm most excited about. And neither is this Mewtwo, but we're going to try and get it out without making it a PSA 3.5. Now it just looks like it didn't finish school because uh, they slide straight out the top. So let's slide out the Mewtwo. Is it textured? Nah, it's regular gloss finish. He's overlooking the city. He does look really menacing. And I guess if you're a really big Mewtwo fan, you might absolutely love this card. But ladies and gentlemen, this right here was the card that everybody wanted out the Japanese 151 set. Like, I can't tell you the amount of comments saying I should open up more booster boxes just because they wanted to see this. Now, for the longest time, I was questioning why this wasn't in the 151 set, but I guess it makes sense. It's going to be the one card that really pushes you over the edge to go buy the UPC. I think this is cooler than the metal gold card, but you guys can let me know if you agree with that or not. But I think a lot of you guys would be buying the box because you just want the sheer amount of packs you get inside. Like 16 boosters is nothing to sneeze at. But you know what guys? I'm feeling like I've got a bit of a cold and I'm gonna sneeze at it. Because in today's video, I wanna open up 100 151 packs to see if we can complete the entire master set in one video. So without further ado, we've got 16 here. We need 84 packs and I know the perfect place. Righty guys, we just made it to the vending machine right here and we've got, look at this, Uncle Lando on the side of it. So this one sells the unlisted leaf mystery packs, but come on, let's have a look at uh, the 150. Yes, look at this. We are fully stocked with 151. I mean, as much as I want to get the Endless Sleep Mystery Packs, we're going to stick with getting the 151 boosts we need for today's video. So we bought as many 151 packs as we could possibly get from this vending machine. And lucky for us, they were already grouped up into bundles of 12, 5, and 1. Now, after selling out a couple of rows, I'd calculated that I'd bought about 71 booster packs of 151. And luckily for us, there's literally a vending machine on the floor below this one that had even more 151 boosters, where we could buy the remaining 13 packs that I needed giving us a grand total of 151 Pokemon boosters. Oh my goodness, let's just pray my accountant does not read my bank account statement because that was actually something else. I did not expect it to get that wild, but you know what? We've got 100 boosters right here and we're going to see what comes of it if we can open up. Oh, uh, is there a card trick? I can't even remember. Let's start this out. I don't think there was, to be honest. We've got Vulpix, Magnemite, We've got the Caterpie. Eevee, Slowbro Chillin, Machoke, Dugong, Arcanine Reverse, Tangler Reverse, and a Mr. Mime. Boom. Oh, snap! Look, it's the rare unlisted leaf energy. <laughs> That's actually a pretty nice way to start it off. These packs right here are out of the UBC, by the way. Okay, put that one to the side. Now, keep in mind, we're not just hunting those, like, art rares. We're not just hunting those ridiculous alternate arts. What's it gonna be? Are they all shiny? What the heck? Darkness? Okay. But we're also hunting the regular EXs. Like, I need the Blastoise, I need the Charizard. Just normal EXs, no shine, pure gloss, Charmeleon, and Omnistar as the regular holo. That's okay. Third booster in, come on. I also can't complain too much about any pulls that we get, just because the ridiculous pulls I got when I opened up my 151 custom made booster box. And if you haven't seen that, oh my goodness, go to my channel, check it out. I may have pulled the alternate art Charizard. And they may have jumped on Pikachu as well. That's a really, really nice Gengar. I love the artwork there, so I'm going to put that to the side. Regular Psychic type, and then these codes look like they've been photocopied. They use the Epson 360 or something. All right, anyway, I don't know. The printing facility downgraded. I think Mark on his office uh, lunch break actually printed out a few of these packs himself and then cut them out. Got Daisy's Help, Dome Fossil, Venonat, and a Weezing Holo card. Okay, this 151 has not got fantastic pulls. Now, if worse comes to worse, guys, and I don't actually complete the set today, I'm praying we can do it. I am probably going to have to do a trade day, but I am open to doing another opening. Look at that, far-fetched as well. 
So if I was to do another opening, guys, what product are you recommending? Like, have you had good luck with this UPC and that's had the real nice, like, hits? I have a feeling the good hits are coming out of the ETB. I've heard a lot of people say they've opened up ECBs. That's where the really, really good hits are coming from. I haven't heard too much about the binder collection. I've heard no one praise the poster collection, so I don't want to open up one of those. And... I guess we could go buy like individual packs, but I just feel like if we're hunting for an ultra rare, it's not going to come too fast. Oh, okay, look at that. Side up right there, which is amazing. And, oh, Kabutops as the hollow. Oh, snap. Our first art rare is a side up, and I love this art to pieces. It was one of the cards I was dying to get in Japanese. Look at that thing. That's awesome. I'm going to put a pile right here just because there is literally no back for me to put the Pokemon cards. It's all boosters, which is the best feeling ever. I don't think I'm missing any regular slots in my 151 binder at the moment. It's a lot of the EXs. Yes, Alakazam! Look at that! Our first regular EX. We're gonna take those glossy starry finishes any day of the week. Got his double spoons. I did see someone talk about how they wanted more Kadabra cards. Give them time. I know it's really exciting. Kadabra's back. You know, Alakazam, you can get the whole evolution line. I have a feeling they're gonna do a bit more with it. Um, but I did see a lot of people complaining like, Oh man, I wish... They did more Kadabra cards. Is that textured? You reckon that's textured? Oh, snap. Oh my gosh. I swear, if we get a god pack, the video's over. I don't even know if I'm actually going to be able to open the rest of the boosters. Like, out of a hundred packs, do you reckon I can get a god pack? Surely, that is going to be the case. Cycling Road? Well, it's not going to be the case here. But we're going to take a uh, Venusaur EX. And look at that. Another glossy uh, energy. Very, very nice. Another card we desperately need. Now, if I can get the other starters, it's going to be great. Charizard and Blastoise. I want this in the alternate textured art form so bad. With all the leaves on it, put it on screen right now. That is a card I am desperate for. Never seen it in person. So at the end of the day, any hit I get is going to be fantastic. Okay, here we go. We've got Fire Type. We've got a Weedle, Zubat, Goldeen, Magneton, Cycling Road, Scyther. Come on, Abra. Mm, it's not going to be a god pack. That'd be cool if I could open up a UPC and I could say the inside of a UPC, I got the God Pack and you guys could go like try to find these. Because I don't think the UPCs are crazy hard to track down. I've checked a couple of Australian retailers and they seem like you could just go into the store and pick them up at the moment, which is really cool. I hate when things are hard to get because, yeah, I'm kind of like you guys. I like when I go out to find stuff and I hate when I can't find it. It's like, this shouldn't be that hard to get Pokemon cards. So seeing the UPC was in stock, I also saw heaps of places had ETBs in Australia, which never happens, so... Yeah, this that's just, it's hard because they don't sell it as a booster box, so if you want to do what I'm doing, it's tough to get a lot of packs, because you're buying heaps of these ETBs. And it's also wild that the ETB only comes with 9 packs, not 10. So who is dealing with these odd numbers? Oh, yes! Come on, UPC! That is what you want, and that is a gorgeous full art! Gosh, that is a good start, guys. We are going to complete the set. I have a good feeling. Put you with our Venusaur EX. We've got three boosters remaining out of our 151 UPC lot. Come on. Hopefully, you guys are getting crazy stuff in those codes. You reckon that was something? Oh, if I can get one more EX. Come on. I can't believe that. We got the Blastoise uh, full art. We've already got the Charizard. No pressure, Venusaur. I'd love a textured version. Oh, Vaporeon. Second to last pack. Second to last pack. Come on. Also, this is going to go way too fast, by the way. This opening is going to be like the craziest fast. Oh, I don't know. When it's over, I'm going to be very sad. Sandshrew. Seal. Come on. Giovanni's charisma. I need some of that charisma right now. Get me through some of these bad packs. Okay, Jolteon. And this is our last booster. Now, what do we got? This is our best pull so far. Blastoise full art. We got our three guaranteed Mew cards slash Mew two cards. Would I say it's worth it? What I pay? It's like two hundred Australian. Oh yeah, I'd say it's worth it. You get a lot of stuff. It's fun, and your pulls might be better than mine. Let's see how we go. The boosters are generous. Dragon Air. If I can get a God Pack though, that might change my no no. That's not going to change my mind. Protective goggles, crappy. Hey, you know what? You know what? It's not too bad. <laughs> We get a Blastoise EX as well. To be honest, look at that. Getting all of this out of the uh, UPC is actually decent. I will take the full-up Blastoise EX, the Venusaur, the Alakazam, and we got the Psyduck with 
Blast Toys EX. That is awesome getting those two together. Man, hopefully we can get a Blastoise full art inside of all of these boosters. 84 of them. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I've busted out my checklist. I'm gonna have it right here so I know which ones to cross off. And to be honest, we are missing nearly every single full art. So this is gonna be a task and a half. I think it's gonna be a good experiment as well. Because I still believe that a God Pack is rarer than 100 boosters. So <laughs> I think we're gonna end today's video. Probably God Pack less. Look at that, it's still so hard. So we got Grabber. We got Drowsy and Vaporeon with the Hollow and an Unlisted Leaf. I'm going to have so much bulk to trade as well, which I'm really excited about. Because as I mentioned, if this all goes a bit side... Oh, there's texture! Yeah, 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 yeah! What is it? We're going to Machop. This... If this all goes sideways, I'm going to trade day on the weekend and we're going to trade all this away. Grabber, Kingler, Sandro. Oh, no way! There's double... It's a... What? I just pulled! Is this... Surely that's not a God Pack! a fire type behind it. Oh my goodness! What are the chances of that happening? You get alternate art blast toys, which again, one of the rarest cards behind the Churizards. You want to get that alternate art blast toys EX. And then, getting the full art? I've already got the, uh, <laughs> we already pulled the normal one. Oh my goodness me! Blast toys EX full art. That is sick. That is a card I wanted so bad. But regular Mew EX is another card that we desperately need right now. So let's open up and keep going. Let's see what we can't get. Surely another... You know what? Maybe the art rares are going to be tricky. Because the art rares seem almost... They're definitely rarer than the regular EX cards, which we have none of. And I'd say I get a lot more full arts than I do art rares. So maybe that's going to be the tough part. Is tracking those down. We got Nidoran, we got Rattata, and a Jolteon as the holo. Come on! I think these boosters out the um, vending machines come from ECBs. Yep, that's something. Oh my gosh, that's a little bit of texture. Calm down, calm down. Little Timmy, sit back down your seat, alright? I see you standing up. Don't get too excited. Go to Spiro, Seedra, Kabuto, Gloom. I thought it was a god pack for a minute. <gasps> it's another Charizard! Holy smokes! Pikachu, I can't, I can't jump in Pikachu just yet. The video is just starting, but what's behind it? Don't, don't give me another double. Oh! <laughs> what is going on? Why is every single time I get a texture card, I'm getting two? Are you kidding me? This is why 151 is the best set of 2023. How do you get a Charizard or Art? The rarest card. This is my second one. And a Kangaskhan full art too. That is the best feeling ever. We're not even done with the first pile yet. Now, ladies and gentlemen, you're gonna wanna stay tuned to the end of today's video because I'm gonna let you know all about how you can win every single double that I pull in today's 100 pack opening. The fact we got two full arts in one pack. I don't even know what's crazy. Maybe the Blastoise is probably a bit crazier. We're gonna get anything here. Slowpoke, Rattata, and an Articuno as the Hollow. Fourth pillar. Seems to have the absolute bangers this time around. Pikachu's really nice. A lot of people were commenting on my last video, you were keen to get Pikachu. So hopefully... Man, you know what? Just even one art ray, to be honest, would be nice. I don't see that many art rays this time around, which makes me really worried they're going to be tough to collect. Got the Protective Goggles, Tauros, and Flareon as the Hollow. Beautiful. These e Oh yeah, we need Eevee. It's another one. I was like building out my binder. Didn't have a regular EV, so be cool to get an EV in our bulk here. Look at that. There we go. Just as I say it. What the heck? So yeah, we need EV. I remember that one we didn't have, and I think we had all the EV illusions though. Definitely didn't need that B drill just then. But just a regular art rare would be awesome. And they seem to be so. F oh, there's a texture card. What is that? Rigid band. <gasps> oh, what? <laughs> No way! How many? Look at this, it's right here! What? Are you kidding me? I am on the first pillar of my 100 pack opening, and I've got two Charizards. So all of these came from different ETBs, I'm guessing. Um, Is that how you do it? You just gotta open up all these different ETBs. How many Charizards can I get out of this? Oh yes! Come on, that's awesome! This war turtle apparently goes for a bit as well, just because of how difficult. Love this ditto, by the way. How good is that art? But yeah, just how difficult it is to get, and everyone wants to line it up with their Blastoise art. So that war turtle is awesome. 
and we can put it with our Blastoise. So those are beautiful. He almost like evolves in the water, which is really nice. It's the last booster of our first pile, which has been goated. Absolutely ridiculous. Let's go one. Oh, I don't think it's anything. Ghastly, got the Nidoran, Paris. Ooh, got the leftovers. Persian, Moltres, Bellsprout, and a Marowak. All right, we got our three pillars right here. We got a checklist. I'm really worried because we need way more art rares. And that's like, you know, art rares and full arts. That's our main concern. And we're getting just repeats of Charizard. On one hand, great. I love repeats of Charizard. I'll never complain about it. But on the other hand, I do need a lot more of these cards. So we might have to do a lot of trading this weekend. Oh, just as we say that. Awesome. We've got a Venusaur EX, Tranquil Flower, and Dangerous Tox Whip. Got the Charizard, got the Blastoise, got the Venusaur. Okay, Venusaur EX, pleasant surprise on the very first pack of our next column. I cannot wait for the recap. Let me tell you, there are some openings where you're like, ah, recap, give or take, I don't care too much. This one, man, it's going to be good. Cloyster, right on. Here we go. Persian. God pack, come on, that's all I want. Imagine getting a god pack. Would make my day. Seal, Doduo, Tentacle, Rattata, Charmeleon, Parasect, Giovanni, Grabber, Tangela. Hey, we need this as well. Bill's transfer. Another full art we really do need in the set. Nice artwork as well. It's still colorful, still vibrant. And Bill, he's always a go. I think for me, Alakazam as the uh, alternate art would be a really, really nice card to try and pull. Uh, Giovanni's Charisma does have a full art in here as well. Kadabra, there you go, all you Kadabra fans. So Alakazam, yeah, all art would be another banger. Come on, Caterpie, Eevee, Dome Fossil, Weedle, Machoke, Dugong. There's not that many Pokemon in the original 151. Hey, finally getting more of these art rares. Oh, Vaporeon. Look at that. That's like original hand sketched almost. I want to say like, you know, Ken Sugimori, yes, but it's just like, that's the original what you'd see in Pokemon Red handbooks when they were explaining the game back in the day. And that's what I love. Solid effort, I gotta say. We're not getting a lot of hits from this next uh, pile right here. But two full arts and a gorgeous art rare. And we still need a lot of cards. Slowpoke, Arcanine, Sandslash, Snorlax, Ride on. Oh, yep, that's it. Holy smokes. And no way. All right, okay. Just the Mew EX. And we're gonna take it because let's compare this one to the metal card. The fact they got both of them in the same episode is fantastic. Look at this, no way. So this one's obviously so much more vibrant, but they look pretty, they're pretty spot on, similar. I guess this one's a little bit darker, this one's a little bit lighter. Which one do you prefer, by the way? Do you prefer like the actual gold? Like, I probably prefer the actual one. Or do you prefer the full metal one? I like the backing on this one though. That is pretty cool. I reckon we might actually build out the binder Oh, can we do anything here? And look at this! Double hitter! Double hitter! Nice! Zapdos as well! This is fantastic! Well, what the heck? The ink is... What is going on with this card? Anyway, Caterpie Art Rare. Amazing. But we got the double here, which is the Zapdos. But it looks like the ink just ran all over this card. Fourth to last pack. Can we get a God Pack right now? That would really inspire me. We've got a Mankey, Scyther, Charmeleon, Abra. Hey, Giovanni's Charisma Full Art. And a Chansey. Holding a little uh, four-leaf clover. Ah, oh, this is a baller card. That man's had a big day at the office, all right? He's chilling out. Oh, he's got all the Pokeballs like back here. Not a bad pile. Getting the Golden Mew as well. Absolutely nothing to sneeze at right there. Got the Spiro, Bellsprout, Magikarp, Mankey, Protective Goggles, Arcanine, Muck, and Machop. Another Vile Plume. Second to last pack. Jinx full up with the big plastic surgery lips. Got the Ekans, Tauros, Kadabra, Ivasaur, Meowth, and an Electrode. The final booster. I'll build the binder out after this one. Let's see what we can't get. Shelter, Helix Fossil, Tentacruel, Hitmonlee, War Turtle, Machop, Poliwrath, and a Flareon. Nah, let's end. Let's end on a hit. Let's try and end on a hit. Then we can like take it straight to the binder and see what we can't do. Volpix, Magnemite, Rigid Band, Graveler, Ooh. Protective Goggles, Eevee, Tangela, Marowak. We're not taking it. I'm not taking a regular holo for an answer right now. Clefairy, Porygon, Electabuzz, Kingler, Sandslash, Snorlax, and... Oh my gosh. 
We're on absolute run right now. This is nuts. Come on, come on, come on. Something. I'll take a regular EX. Caterpie. Art Rare. We haven't had an Art Rare in a hot minute. Haunter. Zubat. Hey, there we go. Ivysaur as well. That would have been pretty cool. Dragonite as the Hollow. That Ivysaur is fantastic. Leech Seed and Vine Whip. Look at those colors. Okay, let's put this away and see how we're going. Alrighty, Ampharos, let me just say, if you've made it this far into the video, the giveaway that we're about to announce at the end is looking ridiculous with two Charizard double ups, but we are missing a lot of cards, and I did not think this would be the case after opening as many packs as we did. We still haven't got the regular Charizard EX. Now, there's a couple of really random cards we're missing, like Raihorn and I think Gakun is the other one. But we are missing a lot of standard EXs like Golem, like Jinx as well. And I reckon the only other trainer card I'm missing as well is the sticker sheet one. Which I reckon we can get in these final lot of packs. So overall we just need a lot of like regular EXs and like three uncommons. Now the art rares we're missing a whole stack right here. A few I really want to get is the Machoke, the Tangler and the Omnimite. And then the Full Arts is just something else. I do not think we're going to be able to complete the Full Arts section in today's video. I mean there's like Alakazam, Wigglytuff, Ninetales, let alone the Ultra Rares we still have to track down like Erika, Zapdos and Alakazam. Not even to mention we still need the Venusaur. So it's going to take some serious luck, but let's keep opening the remaining packs and have our fingers crossed knowing exactly what we need to get to complete this binder. Oh my goodness me guys, that binder took way longer than I thought it would take to build. It's literally the next day. I finished off yesterday, I built out the binder, um, and I just wanted to take, you know, the night to think about how bad this set is going to be to try and complete. It's going to be insane. The amount of cards that we're still missing is bananas. I think for the rest of these remaining packs, I think there must be about like 30, just under 30 packs remaining in today's video. My goal is to get the alternate R EX Venusaur. It would be really, really cool if I could have all three. Oh, here we go. All arts. Alakazam again. It's like our third one. That's okay. I'm not going to uh, complain. I'm going to give away all the doubles in today's video. But yeah, it would be really cool to be able to get all three starters. The all arts. As I said, what the flip is this? It looks like we're about to go on Shrek 4D or something. Gosh, they've really misprinted some of these code cards. Oh, there's another EX. Now, it would be really cool to get the Venusaur, really cool to get the Alakazam, because that's really high on my list to get. But, we need a lot of those regular EXs, somehow still. And there's a couple of uncommons as well I wouldn't mind getting too. Kadabra, and... Hey, it's Golem! I mean, I think we actually need Golem, which is fantastic. Rock Blaster and Dynamic Roll and a water type energy. Now, fortunately for me, I think there might be a trade day, I think either this weekend or next weekend. But the unfortunate part for me is the trade days coinciding with the release of Paradox Rift, which is the brand new TCG set. So it's a bit of an awkward time for me to go out and try and complete the sex. I think everyone might be a bit past 151 at this stage. Everyone might be caring more about Paradox release coming out this weekend, um, or the pre-releases starting to happen this weekend. So, I don't know, I'm worried. What do you guys in the comments? Are you still excited over 151? Or are you more excited over the brand new TCG set? I'm very curious what you guys reckon. Oh, Dratini. Put that to the side. I need that one. Growlithe. I also randomly need a Rhyhorn. So if we see a Rhyhorn, that's... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Ivasaur. It's a double up, so I think I'm giving that one away. And I'm a champ. Yeah, randomly enough, we need a Rhyhorn. I don't know why we got 10,000 Rhydons, but we did. I was like sorting through them all. And I just couldn't find one. Maybe I've missed it. Maybe I need to go through my doubles again. But yeah, I was really curious where that was. I was also looking for an Oddish for like 20 minutes. Anyway, end up getting an Oddish. So we're going to Sea King. We also need a trainer card, which is Sticker Sheet. Hey, it's, an oh, it's another Psyduck. These art rares are so hard to come by. I would give anything for an art rare Pikachu right now. Even the Machoke card though, because it has an open house and the Machokes are moving furniture around. And then the Tangler too. The Tangler art rare is gorgeous. Okay, this is the final booster of that pile. And then this is it. That's our last stack. And we've literally opened 100 151 packs in a single video, which is just like the coolest thing ever, by the way. But you know what's crazy? Haven't even come close. I mean, haven't even come close to pulling all the cards, but we haven't even come close to pulling a god pack. This is the episode, if any, in which you would pull a god pack in. Moltres right there. Don't you think? Opening a hundred packs? 
but it shows how truly rare it is. I know it does feel like everyone and their mama has pulled actually a uh, Pokemon God pack at this point. I've still never pulled one on camera, and that goes for both like Japanese and English. But today would, uh, you know, you'd think today's the day. Look at that. We just pulled an Articuno after a Moltres. That's pretty special. And it would be so fitting if I could get the Venusaur God Pack. Because if I can get the Ivasaur, the Bulbasaur, and my special art Venusaur, man, that would be special. Lapras, Cycling Road, Scyther, Machop, Gloom. We're not even pulling the cards I need. Give me a Rhyhorn. Give me a Sticker Sheet Trainer card. What is this set? I've opened up like nearly a thousand bucks in boosters. Oh no, Porygon. I should have just bought them all. Poliwrath, Pidgeot. Don't do it to me. Don't do it to me. Oh yeah, nice! This is awesome! <laughs> I was ready for it to do it to us. Okay, Golem EX Full Art! I need these cards, guys! I know no one probably cares about Golem EX Full Art. I'm thrilled! This is exactly what I need. If I get more of these, heck yeah. This is tr what a true collector uh, is opening like. Getting excited over the most random cards you couldn't care less about. Just, I need that master set. Ugh, okay. It's looking like we're not gonna actually complete the set today, so I need all your help. Like, give me ideas. How do we go about finishing this thing? Do I do a trade day? I just feel like I might, oh. It's gonna be a tough, brutal trade day because no one's gonna wanna trade for their expensive 151 cards, especially, like, if they're that hard to get. I'm gonna be trading away some banger full arts to get what I need, which is a little bit concerning. Okay, there's the code card. There's my favorite unlisted leaf, holographic, and we have four packs after this. Oh no. Kadabra, Omnimite, got the Ivasaur, Pikachu, come on. Pikachu just show up in the art rare. It would be awesome if I could just see you show up. I got so many comments saying they want to see Pikachu art rare. I'm gonna disappoint them all. Nah, it's another holo. Lickitung, Pidgey, oh, Sea King, Nidoqueen, Charmeleon, and a bleh. It's a B drill. Okay, third to last pack, I think. Or fourth. They keep spawning. Man, that was a really loose booster. Oh, I reckon it might be something. I'm not gonna even spoil it. Voltorb, Krabby, Tauros, Kadabra, Ivasaur. Come on! It's not a god pack, and it's another. Zapdos EX. I, I just I don't know what to tell you. The giveaway winner's getting a uh, absolute bundle of Zapdoses. Okay, I <laughs> open this one up. And it's just turned so salty towards the end. Okay, let's open here. Diglett, Drowsy, Bulbasaur, Slowpoke, Rapidash, Nidorina, Raticate, Fero. No, I'm actually gonna do it. I'm gonna finish this open. This is the second to last booster. We're gonna finish today's video not pulling a god pack and quite literally being not that much closer. I mean, I think we did a good job completing all our commons, uncommons, the regular rare situation in here. But man, there is still so much room to make more 151 videos. This is it, by the way. This is booster number 100. Oh, I should have opened 151 boosters for 151. You know how hard that would be? Maybe I'd do it. Maybe the next video. If today's video gets 5,000 likes, I will open 151 packs. And you watch me still be looking for the trainer sticker sheet. This is it. This is the last pack. Can I get a god pack on my last one? Come on, let's hit 5,000 likes and maybe you'll convince the pack to change its mind. Star you, come on! Parasect, we're going for a god pack! And we're not even gonna get the sticker sheet. Oh, that's embarrassing. That's embarrassing. I've opened up 100 boosters and I'm still missing a regular trainer card. But you know what, guys? We can't dwell on that for too long because I want to give away all the doubles that we pulled throughout today's video. So, the very first giveaway is this pile right here with the Charizard and the Blastoise. All you have to do is comment on my latest photo on my Instagram. I'll leave it linked in the description. And make sure you're following me so I can DM you when you win. And if you want to win this pile, you just have to leave a comment on today's video. Now, as far as the binder goes, we've made a sensational effort. We got so many of the comments, so many of the uncomments. I swear, one of the most random cards we're still missing, though, is this wheezing up here. But besides that, we're missing a lot of the regular EXs. 
which is for some reason hard to pull. I think because there's actually quite a few of them. And yes, I'm still aware we are missing that trainer card. I think that's going to be the one card for some reason I'm not going to be able to pull. But then of course we're also missing those art rares and a lot of the full arts. I really appreciate everyone tuning in to join my journey to complete 151. I honestly think we can do it on the next episode, but I need your help in the comment section. Good luck with the giveaways, but most of all, thanks for watching and keep on gaming. I'll see you in the next one.